demonstration, we will set up our Lollipop camera in our Android Lollipop app. In order to set up a new camera, we need to sign up first. Press sign up. You will need an email and a six or more characters password. So let's input your, our email. and select the password then press sign up the next step is to fill up some of your personal information in this case you can select a picture of yourself one of the parents and a nickname so we'll just press in the camera icon then take a photo and we will take a photo of, any, of anything in our case. Then press OK. Then save. Okay. Then select a nickname. We'll uh, uh, say that we are parent. Parent one or daddy or whatever you want. Then press save. As soon as uh, you press save, then the next part is to connect your camera. We'll connect the camera right now. And wait until it starts to blink in green. The first thing you will see is that the camera lights up. It is an indicator that the camera has power. So let's press search camera and then follow the screen. Press next a few times. In this uh, step, it's really important that the Bluetooth of your phone is on. To increase the success rate of the connection of your camera, Please put your camera as close as possible as the, uh, to the access point. As soon as the app detects that the camera starts blinking in green, then you will see it on the screen. Just press connect. The next screen will ask you to input a name for the camera. So in this case, you can input something like a baby's room or something like that baby room then press save the next step is to search for Wi-Fi in this case your access point press search Wi-Fi scroll down and find your access point in this in our case is this one if the connection, if the signal strength of the Wi-Fi is low, you will get a warning there. Then press continue to input some baby information. In our case, we will call it baby. Then select if it's a boy or a girl. Then select the birthday. Then press it. Then that's it. You have your camera added. If you go to the live view screen, you will see your new camera there. If you tap on the camera, you should see now the live view of the camera.